what makes a good person? Someone with ideals, someone with motives, someone that cares about others, someone that can think broad rather than narrow-minded, someone that's not afraid to take risks, someone that's not afraid to feel pain, someone that's not afraid to go through physical or mental torture. Someone that's willing to sacrifice. And with a lot of things that I'll be teaching the human race in itself, will be a lot of sacrifice in my life. And as I grow bigger, you will all see it. Do you think you suffer from mental illness or do you suffer from depression? Do I think I suffer from mental illness? I think I'm different. And that's the last thing I'll say on the video. You can keep that in there, though. What do all people want people to know about me? Can I twist that question? Sure. This is what I want people to know. The whole point of the human race and the human mind in itself is evolution. Whether it's evolution spiritually, physically, Period. Evolution. The purpose from, from birth is creation. That's all humans do. Everything around you was created. You were created. That table over there created, this chair created, this mic created, that camera created, that hat created. The whole point of the human, of the human race in itself is creation. Before now, when there was at least ideally the, the belief of two human beings on earth, Everything after that was a creation in itself. The whole point is evolution and creation. If you're not evolving, you're doing something wrong. So anything that takes away the power of your mind is keeping you still and delaying your evolution. The whole point of life is evolution. Study your laws of the universe. The law of attraction, the law of abundance, the law of equivalent exchange. Study your laws, the laws of cause and effect, the karmic cycle. Study your laws, dwell into your mind, meditate. Understand that you can alter your realms by your train of thought. The minute you slow down your thought, you're able to leave your body through astral projection. You're only, you're only enslaved if you can't control your mind. So while you can and while you don't have the whole world against you, or you don't have a lot of worries, worry on freeing your mind from this realm, when you can free your mind from this realm, everything is but a thought. And if you can't free your mind, then you're a slave to this realm. The whole goal is you live and then you die. You can die plenty of times while you're alive. The ideal physical death is completion. You served your purpose and then you went. There really is no rest for the wicked at all. I can't ask to project. So I'm gonna teach everybody else to do it, to free their minds and their souls. Or I'm gonna at least, if this is what you wanna dwell in, which I don't wanna dwell in, I'm gonna teach you how to at least be happy or create while you're here. But for those of you that seek out power, follow me. That's what I want them to know. Everybody gotta realize, look at how much I'm doing at this age. So I mean, some of the shit I said on my No Jumper interview, and I don't mean to contradict myself right now, like, at, at all right now, at all. I don't mean to contradict myself whatsoever. But some of the things that I said were very negligent and stupid, yes. Yes, very much so. Like talking about beating that kid in, in jail and even the significance of me calling him uh, homosexual or anything like that. That was, that was stupid. Um, a lot of the things I said were stupid. But the general concept of, of what I'm trying to do or what I am continues to evolve. So you can look at all my interviews and see that I'm evolving. Everybody needs to realize that at the time I was still a kid. Let's take over the fucking world! Do not tell anybody I'm out, okay? I don't know how all you motherfuckers know. Bro, 
It's lit. <laughs> it's over. Dude. Yeah, that's a wrap. <laughs> I think that's cliche. I think whoever came up with that should kill themselves. That's cliche. What's cliche? Just that 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 uh that my fans ideally are uh outcasts. Outcasts or or lame <laughs> or nerds. I think that's cliche. And whoever came up with that was probably a jock in high school. All my fans become very, 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 very obsessed and are all over the internet talking about me everywhere, under everybody's pictures, like, yo, go listen to X, go listen to X, go listen to X, talk about X, let's talk about X. Yo, get, get X on this, get on X on that, get X on this. And I'm talking about if you got five million fucking kids really going hard under your shit, you're getting notifications every millisecond. You think you're gonna be able to ignore that? Self-explanatory.